So this is what happens if you forget. I can hear you, relax. If you forget to put everyone in before it gets dark. Steve? You're not Steve. Steve is there. So who are you? Okay. Well Honey. You need to get out of the tree. Hennifer, out of the tree. Hey, hey. Skirmzy. She's out of the tree. Honey, yeah, I'm talking to you. Get out of the tree. You know, the weirdest thing I find is not even a year ago. Like, it'll be a year on the 3rd. We, like, all this area. There's this little area here. Like, if I stand at this corner and I look back. So right here to that corner there with their sheep pen. I would sit on this stump. And they would sit and they'd be around. And then they had that pen, which was a little bigger. And now they got that pen, which is bigger than that one. One year ago, we started from an electric fence, and hopefully by spring we'll maybe have more than six. Yeah. It's quite interesting seeing how they've grown. And it's hard to believe that when I first got them, they weren't even... They weren't even 20 pounds, some of them. Ah, I tied this up, but I'm gonna go and visit them. Hi, Daisy. Hey, sir, I know I keep forgetting your name because I expect little dude to walk up to me, but he can't care less. He doesn't care about me at all. Hey, sir. Hey, big man. Ow, that is my foot. Thank you. Eat my phone. Leaning on me is not going to do anything, Mr. Sir. Oh, you're trying to get a butt scratch. Hang on. Let me give you a butt scratch. Better? A butt scratch? Yeah? Yeah, you like the butt scratch. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Leaning into me. Better? Sir? Hi, Matilda. Hi, baby girl. Hi, Matilda. That's my girl. Here we go. All these boys are chasing you, eh? These boys be chasing. Hey, Matilda. Nice to see you actually wanted some pets today. Yeah. No? No tail wags for me? How about now? There we go. Yeah. What's going on, guys? You have enough food? Are you okay? What's going on, sweetie? Guys, can you get up? Oh, okay, sorry. You guys usually want to stick together. Like, you guys have enough feed, you're fine. Come on, you. Hey, Steve, what are you doing? <coughs> Guys, come on, go to Steve. Steve will keep you safe. Go on. Okay, you guys gotta at least stick together. Good one, Steve. Oh. Well, why do you keep... You guys spilled your food. Hello. Good morning.
Good evening. Relax, it's okay. I Oh, you got stepped on. I'm sorry. Excuse you. Excuse you. I gotta count you guys now because you guys seem panicked. Meep, meep. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, babes. Okay, so there's three over there. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Oh my god. Three, six, seven, eight. You do not look good. What happened to you? You good? You are not doing too well, buddy. Okay. Twenty-five, twenty-six. Okay. I count these guys now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Okay. You guys okay? For real. You guys, we're all panicked. You two don't look good. I have to mark you two. Let's go check on the quail too. It's okay. You guys are good. I don't want to shine the light directly at you. You guys okay? Sorry. Everyone okay? Oh. See that? We have an egg. Sorry, guys. Sorry, you chill. It's alright. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry, little popcorns. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm backing up. We got an egg. So, today, it's not really a sad day. It's not really a happy day. It's just a day. Um,. What we're going to do with some of the Cornish chickens because I noticed a few of them they're chilling by my house um, but a few of them over there I can't really get up and go Got those two chilling right there they're not doing too good those two right there are going to end up in the pot um, Maybe that one laying right there on the ground. But yeah, those two and that one. Everyone else is fine. Chickens are over there in the... I don't even know if you can see. There, they're just over there. Yes, buddy. I came to show you that... Um, I haven't been putting them in the coop at night. I've just been letting them do what they do. Uh, we did put the electric fence up as like a bit of a... Skirmsy. Come on, go. Go on, Skirmsy. Skirms. Skirmsy girl. Fine. You're gonna go through? Go under? Um, the electric fence, which is not electrified right now, uh, it's just as a preventative because they keep going into the septic field, which isn't good for them at all. So we put that fence up around there in case they do break through, which they have been. But yeah, this has been keeping them mostly in. Skirms. Oh, you dull girl. Skirmsy. <sighs> Trying to help you. Go. Fine. She'll figure it out. She got out, she can get back in. Um, but yeah, so we put the electric fence up so that they can free range in and out of night. Yeah.
forgive my tiredness. Last night we lost three birds technically. Um, we lost two Cornish and we actually lost a turkey. It wasn't uh, the rain like I thought it was. Um, so what happened was uh, I have I went to work and then when I came home they were all crowded right there and I knew something was wrong. And I already, I didn't know that we lost some until I got home. And I counted them up and we were missing two Cornish. But, um, the turkeys were all huddling right where the sheep are currently on the other side of the fence. And, yeah, I walked up and the one turkey hen, her best friend, I'm pretty sure, they're fighting again. Um... She actually had had three holes in her from a hawk and or owl. And so I had to euthanize her, unfortunately. So they have been getting put back in the coop at night. No more outlandish free range for these guys. They have been put in the coop, which they don't like. But they have to deal with it now, especially since the hawks, the coyotes, the falcons... The owls, they're all coming now that they know that there's food here. Last night we actually had an incident. Hello. Where? Okay. We had an incident where I was sitting in the house and I had heard the coyotes yipping and one was running across the yard into the bush there. So of course I came darting out and these birds have no fear whatsoever. Uh, we came out and I, they all followed me to the end of this line and were like, where are we going? I'm like, you guys go in your house. And yeah, so they have no fear. All right. So, oh, I see some fighting going on. Holy fights. Big man and sir. Little dude can care less. Big man, sir. Bless you, Lucy. <coughs> what are you guys doing? Hi. I don't know. Should I go in there? Oh. Anyway, so uh, today I'm doing a photo shoot over there. I got the hay bale set up. Um, but yeah, I got distracted by the sheep. Hats back. Excuse me, Lorraine. Steve. Lorraine. Dude, really? Don't. Don't. Girl. Gar Go. Guys. <laughs> I'm trying to be invaded by turkeys. Don't do it. Well, they knocked that over. Girl! <laughs> Lorraine! Lorraine! Why don't you dare? Lorraine! 
Lorraine, go. You know what? Actually, you're coming for a photo. Everybody go. Well, <laughs> you guys look like you went through that storm. You guys are all wet. <laughs> Check on everybody else. What's up, babies? Oh, we got some eggs. Oh, we do have some eggs. Excuse me. Oh, look how wet. So I found this egg in there yesterday. And I found these two this morning. So we got three egg layers now. It's great. Let's check to see how my little photo thing went. Morning, babes. Oof. Well, I didn't have a tarp. So we're just gonna kind of clean up this little bit here. Well, hello, Missy. You were the only one that didn't go in the coop last night. Hang on, guys. I'll let you out. Oof, we gotta put pine shavings down, man. <laughs> Come on out, everybody. So, I had dispatched two of them. We lost two to hawks and a coyote. So we don't have as much as we used to. Steve is still going strong. Hey, Steve. You guys want some food? Come on, guys. Oh, sorry. Dude, this dude right here is going to be our Thanksgiving bird. This guy right here. He's the second biggest compared to Steve, but we all know Steve is staying, so. Yeah, I'm going to quickly dump this bin. <laughs> 